Hi everyone, in the following video, we'll go over the gallery settings for the pilot theme from Flow Themes. So as you may know, there are multiple gallery settings uh, which you can choose from and customize each gallery page individually. So we'll start off with the very basics of doing a quick overview of the gallery page. In order to create a gallery page, what you will need to do is go to the back end of your website, go to Pages, and click on Add New. You insert your page title. You go here to the side and select the template as latest galleries. Please keep in mind that there are two template settings. There's a gallery template setting, and then there are latest galleries. A gallery template setting is simply an image gallery. Basically, it's a page that has an image slider within it. Latest galleries will show all of the galleries which have been uploaded from the gallery section within the back end of your site. So we select latest galleries, and you can do customizations here. So for example, if you have wedding galleries and you have engagement galleries and maybe destination weddings, you can type in that title here. So for example, this would be new gallery and I just want to add a few categories. So I've added these categories. I can select other options Do I want to have a gutter space between my preview images. I'll select yes. Display sortable yes or no. Um, this basically means that on the top of the page over here you have the gallery category. So if you want to display these click yes. If no then just click no. So I'll leave it at, as no for now. I'll select my gallery view. Number of columns per page. I'll select two. Pagination type, I'll select infinite scroll. I can do other customizations where I want to have a gallery slideshow. And the slideshows are up, uploaded over here. So I'll select my slideshow. Page title, no. Social sharing, no. Content above footer. None at the moment. So pretty much I've updated all of my settings and I can go ahead and publish my gallery page. I'll click on view page and here's the gallery page which I've created. Here's the slider which I selected and here are my galleries. If I select all of the categories, and I can have three columns per page, I'll click on Update, refresh this page, and here we have three columns, all of my galleries come up from every single category which I've selected. So this is how you customize the gallery page. Once again, there are more options you can play around with by enabling or disabling slideshows. By showing the page title, you can add additional text to that page. I'll go ahead and select some dummy text. Click on update, go back here, refresh my page. And here I have a brief description of the following page and my galleries. So this is how you customize your gallery page. You can then add multiple galleries to your navigation menu. They could be sorted by categories like weddings, engagements, lifestyle shoots, portraits, fashion. And each of those galleries can 
show only specific gallery categories.